The unemployment rate in the September 2017 quarter was 4.6%, down from 4.8% last quarter. This is the lowest it's been since the December 2008 quarter when it was 4.4% after the start of the global financial crisis. For men, the unemployment rate was 4.1%, while for women it was 5.3%. The unemployment rate for Māori was 9.9%, down from just over 10.5% a year ago. In the September 2017 quarter, almost 2.6 million people were employed. That's up 56,000 from last quarter. We've now got an employment rate of 67.8%, the highest since the series began in the mid-1980s. Recently, our quarter-on-quarter -quarter changes in employment levels have been volatile, but we think this reflects New Zealand's dynamic labour market. However, if we look at the trend series, it shows a steady rise over time. Annually, employment grew 4.2%. Uh, looking at the industry breakdown, professional and scientific industry, um, so the industry that includes the likes of architects and engineers, rose just over 34,000. Construction rose by about 22,000 people. And public administration and safety, so central government workers, rose by about 12,500. Within the construction industry, we saw the most significant growth in Auckland and Wellington, while Canterbury was rather subdued. Underutilisation is about the potential labour force and the unmet need for work. Uh, in the September 2017 quarter, underutilisation rate remained unchanged at 11.8%. Um, we have about 330,000 people in the New Zealand economy that are underutilised, which is up 5,000 from last quarter. If we look at the potential labour supply, um, and you look for examples of people who fit into that category, you could consider a university student that is finishing off their degree um, and is applying for jobs but isn't yet available to start work.